Tally. Also, he's really good, so I want to say he's from Tally. <laughs> yep. Right, so there's a. Where do you think we are going to go CPU for? That's actually really funny. Mm. Where do you think we're going first? Let's see. I'm not sure what's happening here. Could it be Battlefield? Um. Honestly, probably Smashville. I, I, I don't see, uh, I mean, I know that's the joke, but also, <laughs> Jimmy, Dan, Dan, oh, they are. Yo, they are legends. I'll tell you that now. Yeah, Jimmy and Dan, I've heard the stories. I've never I've never even played them. What's up, Caleb? <laughs> Let's I, go, I, Caleb. I played them both in singles. I played Jimmy in doubles, but now with Dan. Dan left before I started getting good, so I don't <laughs> know. Yeah, I don't know where he's at. I want to I see that team. I want to catch those hands. Anyway. That's the day. Picking their colors. Taking a taking a minute. Dude. Ike? Okay, first off, Ike is a character that you can't sleep on in singles. He's like, oh, you know, you can support his weakness, he's pretty slow, don't get grabbed, whatever. But in doubles, he is godlike. I feel like Ike might be one of the best characters in doubles. Best character? I not, not the best, but one of the best. Like he's he's a doubles high tier. Yes. Especially the freaking helicopter. Yeah. You know, it gets into every single grab. His throws are so good, and he can capitalize. His hitboxes are enormous, so he can capitalize off, like, every throw. I think it's Cloud. Like, Cloud can just forward throw him, and he's just like, Ugh! Cloud and Ike. Nick him like that, dude. Cloud, Cloud, absolutely best character in doubles. I think that that can't be questioned. All right, so here we are. There's, they're going right at it. Oh, it's Smashville. Chez is just spinning around at the speed of sound, man. He's, he's not stopping for a second. If he's not spin dashing, he's charging spin dashing. I'm waiting for a grab right now. Yeah. Come on. All right. Dude, Chez is not getting hit. Dang. Day is going in. Oh. Getting those grabs where they count. I'm liking his ledge game. And he pops the balloon just for good measure. Oh, there's that there. Chez back throws Cloud, Jubal off stage, but he manages to make it back. Ooh. I think they're just looking like a. Uh... Oh, yo, good uh. up air from Day. I was gonna say, this is looking like two 1v1s. Yep. <laughs> Alright, Nathani punishes uh, Chez for that downer recovery there. Oh, oh. Wonder why Cloud didn't do anything. <laughs> yeah. Alright, Chez coming back. No punishment. And Thoreau's going to do it, yeah. Yep. Yeah, and, uh, Jubo was pretty high percent, too, so no shame in that. Will they bring so we, it back up? We have a, oh, I was Ooh. about to say, a pretty sizable lead for Chess and Day. Oh, he doesn't do anything off that grab. I wonder what happened. Must have lost on a jump. Yeah. Tries to get him with the back air, but actually gets hit by an up air in the process. And spin dash combos for days, man. Oh, foot stole the spin dash to back air. That's that's sick. I like that. Alright, blue team is, is kind of running away right now. They 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 got the lead and they're winning. Oh, but there you go. When you grab your own teammate like that, man, th this game commentator's curse is strong with this with this set. Oh, oh double throw. Oh, weird. I'm not really sure what happened. Yeah, <laughs> cross throw. Yeah. He got knocked out of his cross left. Alright. Yeah, Day's gonna Day's gonna take that. Was that his uh was that his forward smash or his side B? That was forward smash. Yeah, it was. Will they make it? Ooh, forward smash to Aura Spear. Oh no, Drew Ball S dude. Yeah. Must be scared of the neutral V. And oh, yo, he's gonna DI it down and tech it. Oh, I like that. Really good back air. And it looks like he's uh, gone. Yeah. Damn. That'll do it. All right, so that was pretty convincing for Chaz and Day, mm -hmm. but they lost their first set against these guys. So who knows? I could. I think they can bring it back up. Yeah. Yep. 
I think, I think it's possible for sure. I mean, they have a strong team. They got good synergy. It just didn't really show in that game. Yeah. Maybe on their counter pick. And is, is this going to be a best of five or best of three? Best of five. Best of five. Oh. So they got they got more of a chance. You know. Yep. They were able to run away with that best of three, but who knows what's going to happen? They deserve this, it. This, this game is silly. It's 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 so hard to be consistent. Mm-hmm. All right, so they're right. they're so mulling they're it thinking. over. Yeah, I see. Uh, I see Jubal just talking to Naphne up there. He's like, hmm. "Do you think that we should go to Battlefield?" Oh no, he's gonna hit us with that. I don't mm. know. I'm just trying to like lip read over here. Chess and Day are ready. They're just sitting there, heads down, like. And there oh, they yeah, go. They, oh, they are going to Battlefield. I thought the same. <laughs> All right, so. That was a weird homing attack, but it doesn't get punished. She was getting hit by Chez's back hairs there. Saved by Sonic. Yeah. I mean, that's really how Sonic needs to play. Like, he'll just hang out and then wait for the opportunity to go in. Yeah. Freaking spin dash. <laughs> yeah. Good on uh, Naphne for avoiding that grab from Chez. But, got them both in the air. Back air. Ooh. That was a cool combo. Chez is a little bit too low percent for that to combo into the back air. Day is out of here. Nicely done. Dang. That up smash from Nappy. Beautiful. Oh. Oh, and he hits his own teammate. Sorry. <laughs> Dude, Ike has so much, so much power. It's ridiculous. Jubal and Nappy gaining on Day. Yeah. He's gonna get throw and oh. just goes right up for the up air. No air dodge. Ooh, charge with the dash attack. Yeah, and I like that. Um, Day was actually standing right next to Chez when he was uh, waiting for the down air. He's expecting the tag. Oh. That was totally worth it. <laughs> that was a really good trade from uh, from Jubal there. That's heavy, boys, for you. <laughs> All right, so it's two stocks each. This this is an even game, 100%. Ooh! Wow. That forward throw, oh my god. Man. They gotta get rid of that Lucario, and they just did. Yeah. <laughs> a high percent in doubles, Don't you don't want to be on the receiving end of that. I can see why they were gang on him. Yeah. But at the same time, they're making him stronger that way. <laughs> you just gotta build that damage and then finish him quick. Oh, get him into oh, more no. speed. Wow. Oh, but he almost kills his own teammate. Still living. He puts Naphne in a bad situation. Good spot dodge there. Avoiding the spin dash. Get them aerials, Jubal. Yeah, I was about to say, Jubal is just running away with these aerials. Oh, my God. Ooh, oh, reverse. Red the roll with the forward smash. Yo, Jubal coming right in to let uh to get Naphne out of that situation. Isn't gonna let Day hit him with the smash attack from the throw. And is he gonna make it back? It looks like he's safe. Yeah, they got stage oh. control to boot. But Day's gonna hit him with a down smash, and he's out of here. Throw combo. All right. God, that up air. That's like a cloud up or a fox up air. That's so good. Oh, he's gone. Oh, damn. Yeah, he's out of here. <sighs> Man. I think it's that neutral B. Yeah. Put in the fear. Yeah, no, it's, uh, there was actually, I think a BP Smash Dudes did a video about it where if Lucario is just waiting for you on the ledge, he'll start charging the aura sphere, and the hitbox extends over the ledge. Yeah. So if you wait for too long, or you get yourself in a re-grab situation, 
or you try a normal getup. It just it covers certain characters. It covers literally literally everything. It's scary, dude. I think he would he would have had to like drop and then up B immediately. I I don't know. I don't play Cloud, but Lucario Cloud has a bad recovery, so. Orisphere you, is just such a good tool for him, honestly. You either get hit or just, you know, fall down. <laughs> yeah. It's your call. All right, so they're, they're talking it out. Looks like both teams. Yeah, Day is, like, directing Chez up there. He's wagging the finger. Only he's like, all right, don't. I'm going to throw him. No, you're going to throw him. I'm going to hit him with a smash attack. Looks like they're thinking it. Yeah. Uh, are we gonna see see a character switch? Maybe. Hopefully. Jeez, that game is so loud. Nope. No character switch. All right. I'm taking it back to Battlefield. I guess I feel really confident in this. First hit. Uh, yeah. Oh, almost. Lucario's getting some damage on him. That's what he wants. Yeah. Oh, true that. Man, it's such a weird mentality. I know. It's like you're fighting Lucario, you're like, yeah, I'm doing good, I'm hitting him. And it's like, no. Wait. <laughs> it gives you false confidence. Yeah. <laughs> Nafti's so good at spacing his aerials. Yeah, that's I. Yeah, he's throwing him out. He's not not getting hit. He's not getting punished for it. Oh. There you go. Oh, but not yet. But he's, only, he's only at like 60%. We're taking it back right yeah. now. Good perfect shield from Chez there. Oh, Ooh. he rolled into the... I guess uh, Nafni actually spot dodged it, so good on him. Yo. Oh, oh there you go. Dang. I was going to say maybe he might survive the forward smash, but he's not going to take an up air on top of it. Red team got a good lead here. Yeah, let's go Pensacola. This, this, yeah, this is very different now. They're doing a much better job of just, like, separating the two and landing the team combos. Mm -hmm. Uh, Chess charged that for too long. Kind of struggling right now. Yeah. Nice landing. Ball. 34%. He's not really taking much damage this stock. Ooh. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's going to do it. Uh oh. All right, so we're tied up now. A little bit of a percent lead, but you know that can be easily made up, especially against Lucario. Oh! He got them both. He got he. Oh my god. Charge that limit up. Wow. I'm, oh. I'm, I'm still stunned by that. All right, so getting back to it, I guess. Uh, Chez and Day try, trying to mount their comeback here. He's got Cloud off stage. This is a good good place for him to be. Maybe if he had, I think if he had forward aired him, that probably could have been the stock. He tried to go for an air dodge instead. Oh. Yeah, forces him to use his uh, limit. It's a wise thing that he saved it. Yeah, that was a confusing Throws. throw. Oh, and the back throw is going to take him. Back throw, or back throw to back air. Oh. Wow. Barely. Now down right. to one stock. Just kidding, it's tied up. Chez and Day say, uh, yeah, you know, that, that was cute and all, but we have our own team combos. <laughs> He's already got a clean 40% on Jubal. Ah, and he misses. Just a bunch of, uh, bunch of strings. It's a follow-up there. All right, Day is getting uh, Day is getting extremely dangerous at that high percent. Yeah. But he's getting closer to dying too. Against characters that hit as hard as Cloud and Ike, he's gonna have to be really careful and make those hits count. Ooh, back air sends Mafney all the way across the stage. 
A good situation. Oh, oh no, it. the shield block. Oh, and he's. Whoa! And Naphne wasn't affected by it. Wait, what? Is, is Team Attack off? Yeah, it's off. Naphne, uh, that was weird. How did Naphne not get hit by that cross slash? Huh. That was. That was weird. Yo, somebody, somebody on chat. Let, let me let me know what just happened there. <laughs> like I'm not really sure what that was. Did he add invincibility or? I mean I don't think you can get invincibility like that. <laughs> yeah, that was weird. All right. Well, anyway, uh, Chez looking to mount his comeback. Oh, that's it. He's gone. There's a catch. Yeah. Dude, that was that was bizarre. I really felt like that uh, that cross I should have hit him. Some I I want somebody to tell me what the heck happened there. Well, hmm. so we're going to uh, going game four. Anthony and Jubal running it back. They're not gonna let him. Uh, they're not gonna go out with a 3-0, So that's good. That's good. That's good. All right here we are in FD. FD, very good stage for uh, Chez and Day. Chez definitely, Chez especially, he's just got room to run around all he wants. Oh, yeah. Team attack is on. Okay. Because I remember um, there's a lot of friendly fires before that, beforehand. Oh, true. Oh, okay, yeah, we just saw it. All right, that makes sense. Well, I'm, I'm glad it was, but yeah. now it's just a mystery what happened. Oh, well. Ooh, there you go, D-Ball. Saved by Naphne. Yeah. See, it feels even worse when... Uh, Playing as Lucario when you lose that stock like that, you're all the way back with no aura. Oh, get the back throw. Back throw. And will oh. he make it? Yes, wow. he will. I think Chez might have not been ready for that. He didn't DI. And yeah, Nathan's not gonna let him. Uh, not gonna let Jubal get edge guarded like that. Mm -hmm. Good on Jubal releasing the. Uh, yeah, that'll do it. Uh, letting go of his up e early. And you just let let it rip before uh, before Chess could space him out with the two frame. Oh. That was an unsafe forward air, but he doesn't get punished for it. We're just hanging out on the right side of the stage. And Apne misses. Missing right now. Yeah. So we're just playing the neutral right here. Yeah. Neither team is really getting too much started. And we're dead even in stocks too, so whoever wins this exchange is gonna have like a pretty sizable lead for the, the game overall. Nathy and Jubal are on their their tournament game. There you go. Or no they're not. Oh. And Chez survived from that apparently. Yeah. Right. Oh. Day's gonna get taken out by that dash attack. Good grab. Right. We got a little bit of punish from uh oh and he gets hit by the last hit of the cross slash. Oh. Keep right. juggling. Day uh Chen's gonna need to go in and protect Day from uh from Nafni here. He's just taking a lot of damage. He's not really able to get anything started. Really good throw invincibility use from Chez there. That's all right. All right, we got Day at 95%. Oh boy. Or a straight up uh, a smash. Oh, is he gone? I think I think he jumped. Nope, he saved it. That oh, and really got him with good. the tilt. All right, Day absolutely needs to stay alive at the very least until Jubal comes out. Uh, until Jubal is gone. Good back here from Chez. 
It's not a good. Si oh. oh, he's gone. He yeah, is gone. He got Let's see if Nafne can make it back up. Oh man! Almost gets forward smashed by Chez there. That's it. Not yet. Heavy boys. Good yes. air dodge, getting away from the up air. Miss spaces his back air. It wouldn't have killed, but it would have been good damage. Daphne is really struggling right now. Oh, is he gone? Yeah, he's oh. gone. No, no. No. Okay. Could have gotten him with the fourth throw. Fortunately, that didn't kill. That's it. He's gone. Yeah. You can't... 2v1, you can't grab against the... You can't grab against Sonic's teammates. The, like, literally, Sonic, anywhere on the stage, he'll run up and up smash you. Mm -hmm. That's scary. But, uh, all right, so we got the reset. Set and two. a replay save. Yeah, grand finals. <laughs> yeah, they really wanted to keep that one. I don't know if that's a Coffee Boy setup or what, but... It's already saved nonetheless in this stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> whoever, uh, whoever owns that Wii U is going to have the second copy of that, of that replay there. And so here we are, Smashville. Smashville Grand Finals set two. Best of five. We're, we're, we're here for a minute, man. <laughs> like, I know. That was a long set. Good forward smash from Chez, reading the roll from Nappy there. Ooh, Navni just smacking him in the face with that back air. Yeah. We're seeing good momentum from both teams here. Nobody's really running away with this yet. But, and just as I say that. Uh. Oh! Oh, got him with the spike. Two balls forward air. He's making really good use of that um, limit charge. Yeah. Saving it for later. So Chez is 65 and Jubal 115. Both of them wanting to keep these stocks as long as possible because uh, their teammates are on their second. So. Yep. Man, I'm really liking uh, Nafni's awareness here. Whenever Jubal is about to get edge guarded or put in a bad situation by Chez, he just comes right in with a back air. Yep. It's like the. Oh man, that's not gonna do it yet. But oh. that's definitely not something blue team wants to be doing. Oh. oh, that was a really good forward air and a good side beat. Oh my god. Oh, the oh, trades. The DBZ, <laughs> oh man. That was that was some Vegeta versus Goku right there, man. Looks like Chez Jeez. still has the sock. Yeah. Chez is stock taken, man. It's really easy for Sonic to do that, too. Oh. He can just run away from everything. But that forward tilt, he actually fell right into it. Oh, there you go. Back air and... Yeah. Oh. Yeah, he took his jump. Jubal uh, risking it all with that finishing touch. and I mean, he, he does land it, but ends up getting hit by Chez afterwards with the back air. And that's, that's a stock. So both teams on their last stocks. Nice. Getting them follow-ups. That was a good punish from Nafni there. All right. Day gets him with a up throw, up throw up air? Something up there. That up air from Lucario is so, so good. Right, oh, and he misses. Yeah. Must be an error. Chez, unfortunately, not really able to do much off of it. Good back air. Uh oh, oh. And a miss grab. <laughs> yeah. 
Read the roll, hits him with a down smash. Didn't this kill is still him. still very doable for Jubal. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Yeah, he's gone. Ooh. Game one goes to Dan Chez. Blue team. Man, mm. what a set this has been. Yes. So, we're probably going to see them go to Battlefield, I think. I think that was where they went last game. Oh, yeah, they went straight for Battlefield twice, actually. Yeah. Looks like they're still struggling with Battlefield, though. So, they might end up choosing something different. They took a game there. Yes, they did. We'll see, uh, Ch Chesende. Yeah. yeah. So, Duck Hunt. There goes Duck Hunt. Hmm. That is not what I would have expected, actually. But Cloud is able to wall jump here, so. And charges limit. Yeah. Easier. And thank God we got we got more uplifting music here too. Oh, bad grab. Friendly grab. Nice space, nice aerials. Chesson Day, landing these hits where they count, putting their opponents in bad situations. Jubal almost getting edge guard. He was actually forced to use his limit back there. And it's not really much of a lead. They're very, even in percentage, they're extremely close. But, oh. Gets back air. Back air's going to do it. Oh, Yo, interrupted by Chez. Really good from Chez. Doing the same thing that Napney kept doing to him. Oh, he misses his up smash. Oh. He wouldn't have killed, but it would have definitely been a good thing to have. It's a miss by Jubal. Yeah. Ah. Oh, he's going to catch him with the up smash. Good up smash from Day as well. So... Dan Chez with a slight, j just kidding. <laughs> Apparently not. Oh, wow, I didn't even notice Jubal was actually holding on to his first stock the whole time. Oh, Chez man. trying to get cute and get him, off the, get him off the top of the up air, but he gets called out for it real hard with the down air from Cloud. That's it. Down smash. That's stock. All right, so once again, very even game here. Good. Day only at 18 percent. Jubal is zero, but uh, uh Napney's actually taking some punishment right now. Jubal, so uh, avoiding getting hit that entire stock for about like a full minute. Oh my lord! A good air dodge from Chess, keeping away from Napney. Need to get rid of, rid of somebody right now. Back air combo. Ooh, almost gets him with the up air, but barely misspaces it. Oh, saved by Jubal. Yeah. And oh. they both get the kill. <laughs> yeah. So Chez and Day on their last stock each. And Jubal only at 75. Good Day DI is. from him, too. Avoiding that combo. But... Nafni getting knocked out of here by uh, Day's forward air or back air, one of the two. It was it was something in the air. Nice catch. And they're interrupting their team combos. It's like Jubal needs to play safe right now. Yeah. If he wants to save that stock. All right. Might be getting edge guarded. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Is he gone? Nope. Right, he makes it back. And get the spike off of it. Yeah. Wow. Chez was actually waiting there to uh, hit him with a forward smash, but he's on his own now. This is a scary situation. Napney actually waiting for the forward uh, the forward throw to come out before he goes for the punish. 
Back air and Chez without a jump. Good recovery. That's it. He's gone. That's all it takes. All right, game three. So what's the score right now? 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. All right. Oh, my God. This set is grueling, man. I'm getting tired just just talking over this. I can't even imagine how it feels to be up there. No. These guys are going back and forth. They're, nobody's letting them. Uh, nobody's letting the opponent get away easily. All right, here we are in FD. This is definitely Chess and Dave's favorite stage as a team. I think mostly because of Chess. I'm not, you know, I think I can definitely see Day liking it too. Um, he's able to be a little safer with his recovery. He doesn't have to deal with like huge end lag if he slides on the ground. And then Chess, of course, just likes running around and spinning. He's very roomy too. Yeah. So. Unlike all the other stages they play. Oh, is he gone? Nope. Oh, okay, makes it back. I thought that was going to be one of the infamous Chez SDs for a second there. Yeah. We don't want to see Chez pull a Chez. No. Ooh. Hit aerial by. Oh, wow. Oh, Yo, did you see that? He actually killed him with an up smash while Naphne was covering the screen. <laughs> I know. Surprise. That was, that was some jank right there. But that's the kind of jank I like to see. Day surviving the forward air from Naphne there. Ooh, that back air attempt is going to get punished from Jewel. You got to get rid of um, Day right now. Yeah, especially since it's Lucario. And they did. Yeah, they don't want to have him at 155. Oh, an interesting recovery from Chesar. He actually goes above the stage and then hits him with a forward air when he tries to punish. Ooh, Vardo is gonna take. It. All right, so Naphne at 119 percent, 127 on the second stock. He's gonna want to hold on. I think he saved Naphne there. Yeah. Ooh, cross slash not gonna do it yet. He was at very low percent still, but. That's a lot of damage. It was a nice follow-up, though. Uh, this is a bad situation for Sonic. Oh, but he makes it back just fine. Playing it safe. Yep. Let's grab. No conversion there. Oh, but that is actually nasty. Hits Jubal with the forward air and takes his stock. So now Chez and Day, two stocks apiece. And we got Day at pretty high percent too. They're gonna wanna take these very fast because both of these guys are extremely capable of putting on damage really quick and that's gonna come in real handy when they lose their stocks next, uh, you know, next. Good spin dash to back air there from Chez. Ooh, up air not quite gonna do it yet. Oh. This is scary. Oh, really good neutral air from Day there. Tries to hit him with the back air but misses and that's gonna be his stock. Oh, and misses, huh? Yeah, good on Chaz, he actually DI'd that straight up, I think. And now, Chaz and Day versus Naphne. Not a good situation right now. Yeah, he's out. All right. Game four. Going back to Battlefield, probably. Two to one right now. Yeah. Maybe uh, maybe Dreamland. I know in three, three out of fives, you don't get any bans. So <laughs> let's see. Maybe not Dreamland. No? Nah. I don't think so gonna be somewhere I don't know they already won on battlefield so I don't know if Dave's stupid Dave stupid rule applies does it mm -hmm. uh, you can't go to a stage that you already won on in the set I don't know how it works here but mm, I don't know <laughs> we'll see there 
probably going to go to Battlefield if they can. If not, I'm guessing Dreamland. But uh, we're going to find out in a couple seconds. So, Yep, Battlefield. All right, there we go. No, uh, no stupid rules here. This is Emerald Coast, man. We're here for the good vibes. Here we are. Going right at it. Jubal is just able to move so much better on a uh, on battlefield compared to FD. Oh, he got that um, smash. All right, Chez waiting for a second, I guess, to see if Jay would get in position, but he was focusing on Jubal at the same time, so he ends up just throwing him off stage. Tries to get a counter. Chez getting hit by the down smash. Oh. Oh, trying to read the roll get up. Almost got him. Oh, he hits him with the back air. Still living. All right. Okay, not going to take it yet with the uh, command grab. Oh, and oh. Oh, wow. Man, that was a punish waiting to happen from Chez, but he ends up missing it, loses his stock. Not a spike. Wow. We got a play? All right. All right, good luck. I'm uh, piecing out, so good luck to these guys. All right, so what do we have? Getting grabs. Up smash by Chez. And we get a, a cross slash and an up air. That was a nice combo right there. Would you all make it? Yeah, he didn't. <laughs> nice catch by day. Nice neutral B by Naphne. It's a great catch. It's a nice uh, limit catch by Jubal. So it's not a good situation for Day right now. What's up, bro? Hello, everybody. I Theta here reporting for commentary. And so, so far, it looks like both Day and Day and Chez have already lost their game against this. I mean, Day can definitely make a comeback. It's Sicario. You don't know. Extra, <laughs> extra. Read all about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I just have a bad case of commentary's curse when I get on this. But yeah, it's two out of two versus two right now. Yep. Yeah, the, it's all tied up. Next game takes it all. It is. And, yeah, so I actually have to play day after this. And, oh. yeah, th I actually saw the bracket reset. That was actually pretty intense. It was. Ugh. Yeah, I am actually really excited to see this last match. Me too. Coffee, boys. Let's go, Picola. I'm rooting for day and Jez here. 
because yeah. Chess is from my area, and I have to play Day, so... You know, <laughs> I don't see why having to play Day would apply to it, but sure, why not? All right, so we're going game five to Smashville. Nafi Day's playing Jubal for Tallahassee Day now. <laughs> and Chez. All right. Let's see who wins. So the thing I can already say is that Sonic is a pretty good team member because he has a lot of stuff to get rack up the damage. Day is also a good team member because of the aura and everything that applies to him. And Sonic's best tool for teaming has to be his down throw because it, it racks up a lot of damage and it can get easy team combos. Oh. Uh, and Cloud missing his recovery. First stock already gone. That's terrible. Yeah, it's something you don't want to see on teams. Team Pensacola is struggling right now. Yeah, so, Luc so Lucario in teams actually has an interesting effect because regular aura does apply to it. But the thing is that, you probably heard of it, is that if he's down stocked compared to his teammate, like, say Lucario has one stock and Sonic has two. Ooh, that was a sick combo. Did Chez try to save him? <laughs> I couldn't tell. It's a good thing he got away. And that forwarder is going to take it. But anyways, Lucario, when it comes to teams, does really well when he has less stocks. Because the less stocks he has in his teammate, then the more he... The more aura he actually has, yeah. The more aura he starts off with, and that means the bigger of a comeback they can make. Of course, the standard aura rules apply to him as well, which makes him insane on teams sometimes. I mean, you saw it at Super Smash Con, and that was that was actually really impressive by them. God, they're missing the team combos right now. It's not looking really good for Jubal and Naphne right now. Yes, they're and playing Naphne safely. Naphne loses the first stock. Jubal almost taking a back air of death. Jubal has to save that stock. And he wastes his limit on the recovery. And gets bodied. It's unfortunate. Yeah, the dash attacks on these characters are really good on teams. I can, I can cloud it especially as teams because they have really good range, good frame data, good combos, and especially with Cloud's limit, definitely makes a huge impact. And the biggest thing about this is that they hit hard and they can hold stocks. Cloud would prefer to hang back more in my opinion because he can charge limit and he can rack up the kills easier than before. This is the limit break. And then Ike is better at approaching, in my opinion. But from the looks of both of the, from the looks of this, it, it can go either way. Yet I do have to note that blue team down to their last stocks. Kario's aura is really big at this point in time. I'm missing team combos right here. They want to do well. They gotta get rid of it as soon as they can. They gotta take their stocks as soon as possible. And bad team communication, and now it's just Chez. Let's go, Pensacola. Chez three stocks. Looks like Naphne and Jubal are going to take this set. And that's it. That's it, everybody. And that'll wrap up teams. Naphne and Jubal taking it 2-3 to three after a bracket reset. Yep. Caleb, give me a hug. Hey, Chez, it's all right, man. It's all right. I'll be right back. All right, so I got a report for my match with Day now, so I'll have to go.